NASA's magnetospheric multiscale spacecraft will study one of the most basic and important physical processes in the universe, magnetic reconnection. Led by Southwest Research Institute, the MMS mission will fly four identical spacecraft in a pyramid formation, using the Earth's magnetosphere as a laboratory. Scientists will study how the Sun's magnetic field merges with the Earth's magnetic field, explosively converting magnetic energy into heat and kinetic energy. Magnetism is a fundamental force in the universe, a force that protects life on Earth and drives dramatic large-scale explosions across the cosmos. In the Sun's superheated corona, magnetic fields create spectacular loops and arcades. The energy stored in these structures can release, creating explosive solar flares and coronal mass ejections. These events accelerate high-energy particles and magnetic fields into interplanetary space. When coronal mass ejections reach Earth, the Earth's magnetic field and the Sun's magnetic field interact with each other in an explosive phenomenon known as magnetic reconnection. The Earth's magnetic field captures some of the Sun's charged particles, which collide and excite atoms and molecules in the upper atmosphere. As these particles travel down the magnetic field lines at the poles, they relax, releasing a colorful glow known as the aurora or the northern and southern lights. The MMS spacecraft include 100 instruments, 25 on each unit. The reconnection sites are so thin that MMS will fly through them in under a second. MMS sensors have been built to be fast, making measurements as much as 100 times faster than previously possible. SWRI provided two systems for each spacecraft, the central data processing units, as well as the hot plasma composition analyzers. With MMS, we will have the first chance to watch magnetic reconnection from the inside. The spacecraft will take high-speed images of the magnetic explosions as they unfold, allowing scientists to better understand this phenomenon.